Hey everyone, um, real quick, if there are any audio problems within this video, I apologize. I have no idea what's going on. I've recorded this thing like three, four times, and it's getting to be hilariously irritating. I don't know what's up. I may have to just uninstall and reinstall Audacity or something. I don't know. But, um, anyway, bottom of the video. Uh, I'll try to make this relatively short, but if I get too caught up in a particular topic, then I apologize. Uh, for those of you who are concerned... No, I didn't die or vanish or anything. I have been taking a long time to reflect, I think, <laughs> I guess you could call it that, on how my life has been going. And for those of you who know me, I don't currently have a job. And I somewhat recently moved from Chicago to a small town called Macomb to try and get a job out here. So far, nothing. <laughs> and almost everywhere I've applied to has not even had the decency to reply back with a denial. So, since that wasn't working, I figured I'd go into voice acting and make that my possible career. And thankfully, to, and thankfully, with the help of some friends, I've been able to land a couple of parts in some small productions, though those productions have not been able to pay at all. I also decided to pick up a music production and analysis as hobbies to keep myself sane and focused. But lately, I've been losing my motivation to keep going with content creation as well as many other things, because of financial reasons. Right now, I'm living with my brother and his roommate, two people who have done so much for me within the past year that I'll never be able to repay them. They don't charge me rent or anything, and they don't even get angry at me for not being able to find a job out here. The most they ask of me is that I help clean around the house and take care of my brother's cat. And while some might consider that living easy, this is like torture for me. <laughs> This is horrible. To not be working, to not be making any kind of income, and actually helping these people out is the stuff of my nightmares. Also, in addition to all this, my current computer, which is a gateway laptop. Yes, gateway. It's I, I resurrected an old fossil. <laughs> a gateway laptop is lately been on the fritz. Um... Any opportunity that this thing gets to either overheat or shut down on me, it takes it. So far, I've had three blue screens of death, and I honestly would not be surprised if I got another one right now. Um, it makes running things like Fruity Loops and Windows Movie Maker and VideoPad almost impossible. And internet... <laughs> my, my Skype friends understand just how bad my internet connection is with this computer, because... I got calls last maybe all of like 10 seconds before they turn into glitch fests and just complete waste of space. Um, I'd have, I, I definitely would have tossed it by now if I had the money, but as stated earlier, I don't have any way of replacing it. And it would cost just as much to fix the computer as it was to buy it four years ago when I graduated from high school. And that being said, I unfortunately have to advertise my Patreon account campaign thingamajig, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> it's been up since sometime last year or so, but I decided not to use it because the idea of having people giving me money for simple internet videos and other things just felt, I don't know, it felt wrong to me, personally. I'm not saying it's a bad thing generally, it just, me personally, it, it didn't feel right. Um, I know I'm nowhere near the level of credibility of some other well-known Brunalysis members to be even asking for this, but I, I genuinely need help here. And uh, your support will not only be able to help me have some amount of contribution to my incredibly generous roommates, but it will also allow me to create better quality content for you guys. There, of course, will be a rewards program. I mean, that's that, that's just basic <laughs> for every channel. So um, don't think you won't be getting anything in return for your generosity. And I want to make this completely clear to anyone considering contributing. You have absolutely no obligation to contribute to this. It will be eternally appreciated and rewarded, but it is not expected of you. And I'm sincerely hoping that people are thinking, oh, well, if he stops making, if he stops getting money, then he won't make videos anymore. Ooh. No, that's not what I intend at all. I do still intend to make videos and music. But, as I said before, in order to be able to actually be considered a good roommate, I have to have some kind of contribution. For th This is just a me thing. This is just a personal thing. I feel as though I have to help out around here because these people have almost literally bent over backwards to get me where I am today. 
in a decent house, in a decent neighborhood, provided we have some crazy, drunken college-like neighbors, but whatever. The point is, they've helped me out through thick and thin, no matter what, and I'd like to be able to pay them in some small fashion, as well as replace old junky equipment that I ha that has been long overdue for replacement. Oh, okay. Now that that unpleasantness is out of the way, there's uh, two things I have left to announce. The first thing is Season 6 of NLP is on its way. Obviously, everyone knows that. And it could not have picked a better day than on my birthday. And since this will be both the premiere date of Season 6 and my birthday, as well as Cadence's daughter's birthday, you know, Flurry Heart, technically, in the episode, that means it's a birth anniversary, which also means that I will have a script in the works which I will attempt to have up either before or on March 6th. <laughs> March 6th, wow. March 26th. And um, the final announcement is regarding my project that I started, the comic dubbing of The Thought. That project must unfortunately be put on hiatus, if not shut down entirely. I'm honestly very, very, very sorry for this. But in order for this project to continue, I would have to obtain the permission of the artist of the comic, Traster. I've contacted him multiple times, asking him for his permission, through DeviantArt and Tumblr, and even email, but so far I've received no replies from him. He's also made it quite clear on his posts that he wants to protect his work, and even cropping images of his comic would require his permission. In addition to that, I have not yet received enough auditions for every character involved in the comic. I've received multiple auditions, but so far I have maybe three characters listed. Or three actors listed for three different characters. Um, I've gotten some incredibly talented people who have sent me their audition recordings, and I would like to possibly work with them in the near future on something else, if this doesn't work. But... For now, it's unfortunately not enough people to have a full production, even if I did obtain Traster's permission. I'll extend the deadline for auditions until June 30th, but if I don't receive enough auditions, or I don't receive Traster's permission to use his work, this project will have to die, unfortunately. So, let me summarize what happened. Uh, one, I'm alive. Two, my Patreon account is now active, and free to donate to, should you so choose. 3. My birth anniversary and review video are coming up, and 4. The thought may have to be put up the past year if things don't work out by June 30th. I'm, uh, I'm honestly very sorry if you guys have been waiting a while for me to make an actual video, and I'm hoping to eventually adhere to some kind of schedule at some point, though, considering how things have been lately for me, that might not be possible, because a good portion of my friends on Skype don't even know this. I've been going through a lot of emotional struggles lately. I don't like to advertise it, I hate advertising my problems, but I owe it to you guys to have some kind of explanation as to why things have not been updated or even posted as regularly as you guys would like. Um, I've been going through a lot of depression lately. I've been having constant nightmares, constant like night terrors, getting up getting maybe like two, three hours of sleep at most at night. Um, I've been putting on a lot of weight as well because of it, because of overeating. And I've considered doing things. I don't go into detail with that, but it, it, a lot of unpleasantness has crossed my mind within the past month or two. But this is not my first rodeo with this at all. <laughs> And I learned by now to I've learned by now how to be able to handle this particular situation with depression and just constant anxiety. And I'm doing my best to put myself out there, to improve myself for others. And this update video is one of the first big steps that I have to take in order to improve and I guess heal would be the word for that. So, um, yeah, I mean, now that you guys know all that's going on in my life, <laughs> uh, now you know. Uh, so, that being said, I'm gonna end this video here, 
Uh, I may, speaking of which, actually, this video, um, the background footage is of me playing my little investigations, which, which I may do a live stream of at some point for either 100 subscribers or for my birthday video or something. I don't know. I'm still deciding. So, um, that being said, hoping to hear from you guys or something like that. I'm not, I'm not really sure. Whatever you feel like doing. Uh, and hoping you have a good one. Bye.